Google defends its Pixel Watch 24-hour battery life claim with detailed states. Hey, it's John Tech here and today we're gonna be talking about Google Pixel Watch. We now know the test Google put the Pixel Watch through to get its 24-hour rating. Google claims the Pixel Watch offers 24 hours worth of battery life. To back up its claims, Google published a page on its supportive site showing how it managed to squeeze out 24 hours. If you have been having trouble keeping your Pixel Watch charged for 24 hours, you're probably wondering how Google came up with the number. Well, Google has taken to its support page to explain in full detail. When Google announced its Pixel Watch, it claimed that the device could provide a full day of battery life. However, when the watch finally made it to consumers' hands, the battery seemed to have trouble keeping up for some. Now Google is defending its 24-hour claims by telling us exactly how it achieved its 24-hour measurement through a series of states. According to the Mountain View-based organization, it got the 24-hour rating by having the watch go through 240 notifications, 280 time checks, a 5-minute LTE phone call, 45-minute LTE and GPS workout with downloaded YouTube music playback, 50 minutes of navigation Google Maps while connected to the phone via Bluetooth. During the Pixel Watch tests, the company says that it had the watch set to default settings and that it had turned the always-on display off. When it all comes down to it, everybody uses their smartwatch differently. Some hardly use their watch throughout the day, while others use their watch heavily. So it's hard to argue for or against the way Google chose to test its smartwatch. But if you're someone who's having trouble with battery life, Google offers some tips you can use to extend battery life. One such method is by turning on battery defender. Another solution is to turn off always on display, like what Google did for its test. And that's everything it guys, let me know what you think about that. And also don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you soon.